Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Tag Force 2. It's me, Cooper, and we're going to be going off and using our deck yet again, our director's deck that does direct damage, to, uh, w to complete some challenges that I think will be very useful to us. So, let's go off to the harbor at night. Hopefully we do good here. Let's see, we got Fusion Utopia, Solar Assault, beat him a lot of times, we don't need to fight him again. Need to remember to get that card later by skipping class. Let's see. Ooh, just powerful people here, huh? Alright, Enzo, I guess you're the weakest person here, so I guess I gotta duel you, but that's not great. I wish I was a little uh, in a little bit better condition. So, the next challenge that we have been uh, tasked to complete is win a duel without using any fire monsters. Um, I don't think my deck has any fire monsters. I don't remember, but I feel like it doesn't, so I think we're in the clear. Speaking of which, Enzo has a deck called Burning Away, which I was not expecting. How funny. So is he going to try and burn my life points? Is that what it is? Is it a burn deck? Alright, looking at this, we're not going to want to play our attack directly cards yet. We're going to want to set up. Alright, uh, no, 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 no. Let's wait. We're just going to want to set up our field. It's, it's a good idea, trust me. And now let's see what he does. Okay, new guy. Ooh, that's a Cure Mermaid. He's going to be healing life points as long as she's on the field. That's a problem for me, so I'm going to need to get out the Dream Clown. Uh, yes, actually. So first, let me get my Giant Rat back, because I'm going to need him. And then, let me get my Dream Clown. So we're not going for direct damage right now. We're focusing on destroying his monster, because his monster will heal him more than we'll do damage. So let's do this. So on Wishes, and I tell I'm going to let you heal. So this, uh, it's called Burning Away, but he's about to heal all of his life points. That's a very misleading name. Huh, wait a minute. Maybe I want your Cure Mermaid. Yeah, you know what? What am I thinking? I'd rather just have- I'd rather just take your monster. Here. Creature swap. Because I want the- I want the ability to heal life points. And then I'll do damage to you. Let me do this. And then battle. Yeah, this'll do. Oh, I didn't even put both of them in attack mode. That was a mistake. Uh, can they attack each other? Didn't think so. Okay, uh, yeah, you attack, uh, directly. It doesn't matter. All I need to do is attack. They all, it's, it, all of this is basically direct attacks. Take this Enzo. I did use most of my cards to make this happen though, so hopefully he doesn't have any backup cards. That'll save him. But I have a giant rat and I have a dream clown just in case he do, tries to do anything funny. Like snatch steal. And if I can get one of my better spell or trap cards, I'll be able to get him. Okay, let's see. Draw Royal Knight. What the hell is that? Fairy monster... Okay, I don't know what that is. It's just a knight, I guess. It's not that scary, though. Okay, draw a card. Jinzo number seven. Happy to see him. I'll stop you from healing. Wait. Oh, okay, whatever. He got to heal. Good for him. Um, this card... When this card destroys a monster as a result of battle... and Oh, it wasn't sent to the graveyard, so he didn't get any life points. Very good. Cure Mermaid, you're surprisingly strong. She has 1,500 attack for a mermaid that's supposed to be cu curing you. I don't know. I guess that which heals can also do damage. So there you go. There we go. Wow, this deck is weirdly good. <laughs> I just made it on a whim because my last deck was the Toon deck, but with the same kind of strategy. And I was just like, but what if I went all out with that strategy? And I complete. It would it would work on a lot of these challenges. And it's like, yeah, it totally works on a lot of these challenges. Woohoo! So, let's see what he does. He destiny draws. What are you going to draw? Alright, that's probably not the card you were destiny drawing. I'll take the damage. And let's see. Cure myself a little bit. Thank you. That thing only has 1300 attack, right? Alright, let me activate shooting star bow anyway. Here you go. I give you a 300 attack. That's the second use I have for this equip spell. Eh. And that's one of the reasons why. Gravity Bind. Yep, that was one of the reasons why. And now it doesn't matter, because my deck works really well around Gravity Bind. So well that I probably should run it in my deck, but I don't. I don't know why I don't. I should probably do that. Uh, yeah, completed the challenge. Heck yeah. Won the de duel without uh, any fire monsters. Alright, let's look into the challenges really quick again. See what, what else we can try to complete. Let's see. Oh, I guess I didn't complete the challenge. Weird. Maybe I read the challenge wrong, so maybe I was wrong about that. Doesn't matter. Let's try... Do, 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 do. Okay, let's go really far down. Let's try to get into the 60s. Because all the other stuff is a little difficult. 
Okay, let's see. One with a deck that didn't contain... Oh, except fire monsters. Whoops. Oh, wait, I already did that in the past, though, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, so I, I, I that was a mistake. Whoops. One with a deck that didn't contain any monsters except pyro monsters, contain rock monster, fish monster, dinosaur, dinosaur, yeah, yeah, yeah. I should have done these earlier, but I'll, I'll make decks around those later. Uh, da, 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 spirit, deck with the dead, any monsters except two monsters. Should have done that too. Uh, one with the dead, 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 smells. One with the deck of 80 cards. One with the dead, that didn't contain any limited cards. I can do that easily. One with the dead that only contained one copy of each card. I don't think I could do that easily yet. One without performing a normal summon, one without performing a special summon, one ten co coin costs in a row. So, of all of these, the best thing I can do with this deck now is probably special summons. Yeah, because I have a lot of special summons in this deck. Still, it's going to be a hard challenge to pull off. It's not exactly a special summoning deck, especially if I'm winning. If I'm winning, it's not great for that. Alright, you know what? Let's just go. Yeah, let's go home. It's time to sleep. It is time to sleep. All right, it is Saturday, everybody. This is going to be interesting. Tom I forgot that tomorrow is going to be a duel tournament, and that means we're going to have to duel with our freaking Attack Directly deck with Jesse, which I've never tested that theory. I don't know if my deck is very good when working together with somebody. Hello, you? Are you guys dueling? That's kind of cool. Uh, I'm going to go to class. Uh, actually, no, I'm going to not go to class. And then we're going to... Yeah, we're going to skip class today. And then we're going to go to places, and we're going to start getting uh, some of them uh, Exodia pieces. Let's go over here. Get me Exodia piece. Very good. Now let's go over here. Let's go to the Chancellor's office. That'd be hilarious. Hey Chancellor, wait, shouldn't you be in class? No, screw you. I'm here for I'm here for Exodia. <laughs> He's like, damn, one of the kids figured it out. Ditching school is how you actually succeed. Yep. <laughs> Alright, is he actually here though? Oh, he's not even here. He's probably uh teaching or something. I don't know, he's doing his own thing. Now that we've done that, let's go. Where's the other guy at? The beach? Yeah, he's at the beach, right? Oh, wait, I think class ended, so... Yeah, class ended, so everyone's back. Never mind. What about you? You six samurai guy? Okay. I already dueled him, though. Burning away. I already fought Enzo. Bear strength. Oh, it's uh, Blair again. Look, Blair, you have a 2 -oh... Look, you have a good win streak against me. I want to end that. It's a 1v1. Best 2 out of 3. This decides it. And I'm using a deck so far. I think a deck that's been undefeated so far. Except in the in the place. What's it called? In class. In class it was defeated, but that doesn't count. If you're in the abyss, it should not count. I mean, I don't even have the full life points or any of that stuff. Even if I have the advantage. Alright, directors. Let's do this. Maiden Kiss... Dueling romance or both a battle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're too young to care. You're too young for me to care. Let's go with Dust Tornado. Let's go with Bubonic Vermin. And let's just wait. Because I have future plans. Alright, once I get Spirit Barrier, I can start attacking directly. But for now, I think I'll just stay and do nothing. Okay. I'll set another card. We'll just keep playing defensively. And yeah, we'll destroy her Spell Trap card. Might just be MST anyway. Alright, it was Magician Circle? Oh boy, I'm glad I got rid of that. She can summon a Dark Magician Girl real easily with that. Or any uh, Magician of her choice with less than 2,000 attack points. 2,000 or less. Alright, so let's see. Dream Clown! That's one hell of a monster to pull. I'm gonna summon the Dream Clown. I'm gonna flip you. I'm gonna flip you. I'm going to do the effect. Yep. Dream Clown, I'm going to actually give you this effect because you are super useful to me. So, you not being able to be destroyed by card effects or battle will be very, very helpful. Okay, Lava Coup. Oh no, that's uh, that's Enchanted Javelin. It looked like Lava Coup. And my turn's over because that was the Unhappy Maiden. Lucky you. So, I'm going to take some damage for this. Oh boy, am I... Yep. Oh, wait. Wait, you play her in attack mode. Why would you do this? Are you crazy? Just because it's not destroys. Wait, most of battle with this card cannot change its battle position except uh, with a card effect or attack while this card is in attack position on the field. Okay, so I need to get rid of that card. It actually is a problem for me. All right, and I'll play the second one on my girly here, and then I wish to do this. I activate creature swap. Let me see which one you're willing to give me. Okay, you're face down. Oh, it's just the same thing. Hmm. <laughs> I'm glad I got rid of it then. Okay, you. Get rid of her because she's actually a threat. Unexpectedly. 
And then you're stuck, so that's fine. This thing is my monster, which is you, so this is fine. And let's battle. You do this. Thank God all my monsters are so weak. <laughs> They're not even a problem. She doesn't have the monster to special summon, so it doesn't matter. 350 directly and 1,000 directly. Yeah, we're doing it, guys. Sangan. She may have healed herself off my Dream Clown, but this that's it. She can't do anything else. So, what are you going to do now? Now that I've taken your ultimate monster that stops me from killing you. Alright, change this. Do, 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 do. Put you here. Let's put you in attack mode so I can start using you for real. Go to battle phase. You try to kill this one. Oh, wow, we actually could. And you're going to summon another one. Mmm, you want to end my turn. Okay. Well, if she's going to end my turn anyway, I might as well just attack directly. Do a quick little 350, you never know. And then you attack. Unhappy girl versus unhappy ma maiden. Unhappy girl wins this fight because it ended my battle phase. Yeah, I don't know why girl and maiden are different. I think they're the same card. In my, in my opinion, they're the same card, but I don't know. I, I could be crazy. Uh, we don't need the we don't need any spar track artifacts for a second because I'm about to do this anyway. And pop you so we don't have to lose a turn. Hey, it was her it was her card, Made in Love. Yeah, holy crap! I used a, a spellcaster Made in Love deck in the last game and I called it. Uh, oh god, what did I call it? Love magic or something? Or, or yeah, something like that. Love magic, I think. Yeah, probably, maybe. That sounds like a name I would give something. Yeah, it was worth a dark. It was a dark magician deck mixed with Maiden and Love, and it actually did do some work. It wasn't the best card. It wasn't the best deck in the game, but it worked. All right. So, what are you gonna do? I have the perfect setup here, Miss Maiden Girl. I'm not gonna be able to special summon ten monsters this turn, but I'm definitely gonna be able to beat you. Uh, too bad I have too. I have too many monsters on the field. They can't summon my stronger Dream Clown. Uh, this is the price you pay when you have a tri when you have no tribute monsters in your deck. Maybe I should add one. Maybe I should just add one for no reason. Like, eh, well, maybe between episodes I will. This episode, I think this deck is working great. We don't need to add any monsters. Do do do, Bubonic Vermin. Of course, it's only working great because I've only challenged up to raw yellow students. It's not like I fought all those blue yet. But if I beat all those blue, that means I'm amazing. So, let's see. Blair's down to her last thousand life points. I think I've won the duel. Hmm, that's a good, uh, save your life card. Hmm, that monster's stronger than my monsters. Let's, uh, put that back in your hand. Thank you very much. That's why I've been holding back. And, uh, oh, two face-down cards. Okay. I don't, I don't think she drew two face-down cards that would actually save her in this case, so I think we won the duel, guys. Let's go ahead and do our 1,200 damage. Yep, that's it, guys. Blair is defeated. Somehow we didn't take any damage, which I think is a challenge, so I should have done that. <laughs> I should have done that challenge. That challenge I can actually complete. Yeah, I won another duel, man. I'm doing good. I did say almost blue, didn't I? All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. I got to put my money where my mouth is. Here I am, guys. I duel you. Can I defeat this opponent with my deck? of just direct attacking, no strong monsters, no tribute monsters, nothing like that. All right, second to go? All right, good. I'm going first, I wanna set up. So, Emperor's team, uh-oh, I don't like that. I don't think I like that. The directors don't wanna fight the emperors. Okay, good, I started with Bubon. Ooh, I started with a few good cards. Nothing to protect my monsters, but something to protect my life points and special summon more monsters. And protect me from spawn trap cards and protect my life points. Okay, good. Lots of good stuff. Lots of good stuff is what I just got. Okay, set a monster, set a card. She ended her turn, so I'm gonna dust tornado that card before she even tries to activate it. Let's see what it was. It was called a haunted. Good. I'm glad I got rid of that. Okay, giant rat. You are going to be ballsy and uh, attack the opponent because I'm gonna flip you. This will let me special summon, but before I special summon, I want to activate Spirit Barrier. Because if I'm about to, uh, yes, I would like to do that. If I'm about to attack opponent's monster, I want to make sure I have enough attack points. Okay, you go there. Let's see if we can do it. Hey! It was Exile Force. I'm surprised she didn't do, uh, save that monster. 
monster's way better. So if he's if she's using warrior monsters and it has to do with emperors, that's not good. That means she's probably going to have marauding captains, command knights, and all that stuff. And brain control, which I'm not actually afraid of. Because I'm not going to take any damage from this. Oh, go ahead. This will, this will be fun. Ah. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, shit. She destroyed my back row, which is the most important... Uh, which is the most important row in my deck. Oh, God. I didn't think the monarch counted... Oh, I guess monarch is not an emperor, but, you know, it's like the same idea. Uh, Gucci, you go in the field, you protect me until I get a trap or spell card that can save me here. She kind of she kind of got me by the balls now. This is why I was afraid of all those blue students. No, attack the other one. Attack the vermin. All right. I don't care how many monsters you have. My plan ultimately is to attack you directly. Okay. Summon you. Summon you. Set you. And we wait. This is all to stall until I get my spell and trap cards. Mmm, Morphing Jar. Perfect card for me, honestly. Thank you. Thank you so much for doing that. Hey, you have one too. Cool. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It wasn't a tribute. He didn't tribute a monster, so it doesn't count. Uh, yes, I would love to use that effect. Alright, goodbye, Jinzo. Sorry, buddy. So, looking at my hand, this is going to work out just fine. This is going to work out beautifully. Oh my god, is this going to work out beautifully. So we're going to do this. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> then we're going to play you in attack mode. You in attack mode. And we're going to activate Monster Gate, because this doesn't count as tributing a monster. It's just tribute. So, do that. Nope. 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 Okay, I'm losing a lot. Ah, why not, Rainbow Flower? You get, you get over here. You're adorable. And then we're going to set you. And then we're going to summon you. And we're going to battle. And then you're going to battle you. Yeah. You're going to battle you. She got two of her monarchs out. That is actually a problem. If she only had one, this would be wouldn't wouldn't be a problem for me. But she has two, so this is gonna be rough. Gonna do that. And I will save my spell card even though I have plans for it. I could use it on her monster if I have to. I'm gonna let her destroy the flower, it doesn't matter. Flower is not too important to me at the moment. No face downs is all I care about. No face down monsters. Dream Clown, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Come here. Okay, let's activate the shooting star bow. Get you. And then you attack you. Yeah, destroy her own monster, why don't you? There we go. Uh, no, I don't want her to bring back her own monster. That would be terrible. Let's see. When a monster is sent to the graveyard as a result of battle, you can return it to the field in the same battle position as a special summon. Cool. I'll do that when I can. Another exile force that she wasted. Wow. Wow, what a waste of a monster. You could have used that to get rid of your own monarch. Do you not know how to use your cards? You're an almost blue student. Come on. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. This is going to be terrible. I can already tell. I'm, 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 oh no. Oh no. Oh wait, I have, oh, oh wait, she didn't attack my Dream Clown, which was the right monster to attack. You, in fact, made this impossible for you to win now. Because I am now going to get my second Dream Clown. And now I can destroy everything. The world is mine. Okay, this is, this is like the perfect combination. I cannot believe that I'm in this situation right now. I have everything in my hands. This is so good. It started so bad, and it just became so good. 24. 1200. <laughs> I think I won this duel. I don't know if the, she has a chance of winning this. I don't know what she could pull off. That, you know what? That's a damn good start. Hmm. Okay. But what does that even do to me? 300 damage? Okay. Look, I, this is good because you did, you're did you doing good, but this doesn't save you from losing the duel when you're at 100 life points left. Because I could just attack you and I win the duel. Right, I'm going to activate Mon's a ride, a Rod of the Mon's Eye, whatever, and put you in attack mode just in case. And then we're going to battle, and I attack you with this, and I'm guaranteed to do 1,000 damage. <laughs> that was weird. This deck is so good it can beat all those blue students. I didn't know. I didn't know I made a good deck. Wow, that wasn't 10 special summons, huh? Well, I got $1,000. Did I level up? Is that why? Why did I get a 900 DP boost? 
It doesn't tell me, so I need to know why. Someone at home, please tell me. I need help. Hey, we're working on our third heart now. And guys, I know it seems like an earlier episode, but we will be ending it off. But I'm not going to let us end it off without buying some cards. Come on. I'm not a monster. I'll buy I'll buy some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. That's important. Hey, that even makes him happy. I think all these victories are putting him in a good mood. All right, let's see what we got today. We got Earth. I like me some Earth monsters. That is for sure. Get me a lot of these. Because if I can get some more giant rats, this deck I'm using right now would be more useful. I only have one giant rat at, the po at this point in time. And then this is for a future deck that I plan on making, so I need a lot of these. In fact, I, I should spend all my money on these packs. Because I don't have the cards I need yet. Oh, I could have bought more, but whatever. We'll save that 100 for next time. Rainbow Flower. So I got something good out of that. Hyena would be good in this deck too, honestly. Got more Rainbow Flower. Big March of the Animals, that's a fun card. Looking for Giant Rats. Come on, Giant Rats. DD Crazy Beast, meh. Mmm, Bazool's funny, but I already used him. Trojan Horse, okay. That Dog of Darkness, good to see him. Horse Rider again, I love that card. Of all the 1900s, probably Gemini Elf is, is up there is one of my favorites. 1900 normal monsters. That amulet card is really good. Ancient Rules, that's a good old school card. I like that. I like that. Like it, Thorpe. Good to see you again. Heart of the Underdog. That is something I need three of. <laughs> I need three of those. And that is the card I've been looking for. Of course it's an ultra rare in this pack. It's so good. It is so good. Guys, I am so excited that we got one of them because I could still use one in the future. But more, the more I get, the more powerful I become. So guys, that is going to be it today. I want to thank you all for watching. Next time, we will be using more of the director to complete more of the challenges. And hopefully, we'll win. So, see you all then.